guys, welcome back. This is Mavis here with you, and we are playing Seven Days to Die. And I hear a horde. And it's probably just a wandering horde, but we built the other place to do battle, so let's run over there and see if we can't engage the enemy a little bit. Uh, I'm working on getting my health up to 200. We're on our way. Sorry, I look like crap today because I am sick this weekend. Um, you guys will see that in the videos that I did with Joe. Um, speaking of those videos, I accidentally recorded with face cam and didn't know I was recording with face cam. So I haven't actually edited them yet. And I'm hoping that I didn't pick my nose or do anything crazy like that. So you guys will have to excuse me if I did. <laughs> And I was sick yesterday also when I recorded with him, um, so that's not going to be pretty. He didn't have makeup on, um, I had taken a sh- maybe I- I can't remember if I'd taken a shower yet at that point, um, but I surely hadn't done anything with my hair. Um, I showered today, but I didn't wash my hair. No makeup, I don't feel good. I wasn't even really going to record, but then I thought maybe I should. What's up with this bee? They ran over there. You know, I kind of wanted to get some more ammo. I guess we're alright on ammo. We should be okay. Stupid fog. Okay, so I have a plan today. Um, this is probably going to be the last week for the series. and I don't know how many episodes I'm going to get up this week, so... I hope today isn't the last episode, but it could be. I didn't have a live stream this weekend, um, partially because I'm sick, and partially because I was out of town um, Thursday and Friday. Um, we went to Milwaukee for work, and then I was... I hope I don't get ambushed here. Um... Search the mini bike. Do I have anything in my trunk? I do. Let's take these things out and put them over here. Okay. Let's put some other stuff in here because I'm going to take this apart. And hope Oops. That's not what I wanted to do. Hopefully I don't screw this up because I never do this. Um, so... Um... No? Uh oh. Oh no! What did I do? Oh shit. I think I just. Oh man. Oh okay, good. It's all in my inventory. Okay, good. Yay! Okay, it's been such a long time since I've done this. Can you break these down or anything? No. Okay, I made a better frame and a seat. It was recommended that I do that, and I did. And I'm probably gonna get jumped. Okay. So, we can just drag these on here, right? Wish I had a better engine. The seat is by far better. Um, and I think that's it, right? So let's repair it all up. And then I think... That's good. <clears throat> okay, let's get back to the things that we do want. And probably need gas. Okay. Cobweb. I don't need a cobweb. Alright, so I want to head to Club City. I can't remember if I have... <coughs> Um, explored. I don't think I've explored at all. And I don't think I've been inside the little town. Or the little, there's a shop there. And I hope I, uh, marked the right place. I think I did. So, yeah. Um, my trip to Milwaukee was pretty cool. It was entertaining. <laughs> um, so, we took a like a big bus. Really, me? Don't even try it with me. 
took a big bus and had a bathroom on it, all that kind of stuff, which I was pretty grateful for. I ended up having to use it on the way back. Um, but I sat with, um, with the girl that I was rooming with on the trip, and, um, I sat up against the window, and it was pretty cold outside. It's cold right now. It's November, and, um, it kind of felt to me like, like, the window was, like, sucking the, the heat out of my body, and I kind of think that that kind of helped make me sick. And then there were people that were sick on the trip and stuff too, but just being away from home and um, the hotel was really, really dry and I've actually been using a humidifier at home and so I didn't have that um, access to me at the hotel and it was really hot and um, my roommate liked having um, like a fan on so that she could sleep. So there was air constantly flowing and I was just dried out and... Um, the first day when we got there, we were kind of turned loose for a little bit on our own. Let's check this bag real quick. There's a wandering horde. Oh, I picked that thing up, didn't I? I did. Nothing I want. Hey, y'all. How's it going? Um, so we went to, um... We went to walk around a little bit. There was supposed to be like a mall nearby us. So we went there and um, there was a TJ Maxx, which we have a TJ Maxx here, but you know, we went in the TJ Maxx and I ended up <laughs> getting um, a little Christmas present for my niece. And then um, the rest of the mall pretty much was like empty. There was nothing there. And we ended up figuring out later that if you walked like, I don't know, maybe a mile down the road, um, is this the way? Then, like, that was the, uh, another entrance to the mall, and, um, there were more stores there, but we completely missed that. And then, um, there was a, a like, a pub, an Irish pub right across the street, and everybody was in there, and, uh, it was kind of early in the day, and I didn't want to have to be, like, peeing all day, so I didn't drink while we were there. I, I just didn't end up feeling very good, so I didn't do much drinking on the trip. Um, so we went to the Irish pub, and we hung out there for a little while. And then um, we went back to the hotel and got ready for dinner. We went to a pretty fancy place, um, Rock Bottom Brewery, and had a really nice dinner. And I wore a dress and heels and all that stuff, and everybody looks nice. And then after dinner, we went and saw Wicked, uh, the musical, and I'm, I was super excited about that. That was like my favorite part of the whole trip. Um, I have read the book and I really enjoy the whole Wizard of Oz story. So I was very excited that we got to go see that. All right, we're in town now. This is gonna suck. Um, the gas station. Have I checked too far? No. Okay. Don't really need any of that. What? There are cars here I haven't checked? Oh, that battery is better than the one that I have. Okay. Um, I kind of want to be a little stealthy at least. Um, so, Wicked was freaking awesome. It was so good. Um, oh my goodness. Oh! I'm gonna go check this car. <laughs> I'm looking for a headlight so I can make a new steering wheel or steering thing. Don't want any of that. Um, what else? So, one thing about dinner, I don't even know if I should tell you guys the story, but I'm going to tell you anyways, because it was a little bit of excitement, sort of, I guess if you want to call it that. Um, so, we have a lady that works for us, and she's pretty much the second in command. She's helped start this business, and, 
Um, she's second in command. And she has been having some issues here in the past few years. And she should probably quit drinking. Um, she, a couple years ago, went on a houseboat trip with her friends and her husband. And pretty sure there was drinking involved. And she ended up falling and, like, fell into the houseboat and smashed her face and had to have reconstructive surgery done on her face. And screwed up her sinuses and all that jazz. Oh, this is a shamway? I'm not interested in shamway. Um. Let's stop for a second. Let's look at the map. Okay, let's go down this way. We haven't <clears throat> opened up everything down here. Smashed her face. Had to have reconstructive surgery. She was a hot mess for quite a while. Um, and she still, like, can tell when stuff's going down with the weather and stuff because her sinuses just go crazy. Um, weren't we just here? Maybe I have seen all of this. Alright. Well, let's swing back around and, like, maybe head out of town a little bit. I think at this point I'm cool with, um, maybe riding at night a little bit. I've never done that, but this is sort of towards the end of the series, so we'll try it. So... Then a while back, she perhaps did the same thing. I'm not sure. She, I don't know if she's like being honest with us anymore about like whether or not there was alcohol involved, but I know that she likes to drink. So, um, she ended up falling down and hitting her head and supposedly had a seizure, but I'm not sure if like that's what it was. Okay, this might be the store that I want to go into. Where's the cop? Mm. There he is. Excuse me, sir. Holy balls. I will take those, thank you. Oh yeah, um, somebody commented on my video and told me they think I'm shooting high, and I think you're right with the shotgun. Have I been in here? I don't think I have. Um, I'm not gonna be able to get in there because there's a filing cabinet. Really, I think with an axe I would have just like manhandled that thing. So, basically, on this trip, like I said, everybody was drinking. Um, do we have a flashlight? We do. Um, way before, they had spent a couple hours at the club. And then, um, we went to dinner and everybody was drinking at dinner. And, um, they actually went outside, oh damn it, to smoke a cigarette. And I was sitting up against the window table near the window and I could see like out on like, the back area where everybody was and she ended up falling down and it looked like she might have been having a seizure but I'm not sure if it was like alcohol induced or what was actually going on and we were all like very concerned about her like it was pretty scary like it was at the end of dinner thankfully um but we were all getting ready to have dessert, but it was just, it was so scary. Um, and so she didn't go to see Wicked. She went back to the hotel. So yeah, that was, that was the excitement for that night. Um, I don't need that either. I don't know why I'm going to be carrying that around with me. Uh, I don't need that. So, um, the next day, we got up early and went downstairs, and they had a really nice breakfast in the hotel. I was actually pretty impressed by it. Um, so I ate a ton of food, and then that's when I started feeling not very good. Like, I just started going to my stomach, and went back up to the hotel room, and hung out for a little while until we had to leave, and then we ended up going to, um... The Miller factory, Miller Coors factory in Wisconsin. And, um, to 
toured the factory, and keep in mind it's Wisconsin, and it was spitting snow, and it was very cold outside. <laughs> no dog! Fucking heart attack. Hey, dog. Fuck off. Oh my gosh. I wish I could shoot my gun on the mini bike. There's a car over there I kind of want to go get. Hey, cop. What's up? Okay. Oh, there's an airdrop. Should we go look at it? I don't know. That's like distracting me. Okay, make sure the fingers are on the right keys. I want to go check out this car. Have I been inside this car? There's two cars here. I feel like I have them. Yes. Oh, there's a bee. here. So, yeah, the tour. Cops, they're trying to bark on me. Um, so the tour, we had to walk a little ways, uh, which was no big deal, except that it was fucking cold. So it was about four block, about at least a four block span of buildings, and um, we would you know, walk to each building and then go inside and kind of see things, how they worked, and it was really awesome to see, but the going in and out of the buildings contributed to me not feeling good. And then, um, we went up into one, um, place, the brew, ha brew house, where they have, like, the big tanks and they put all the, the grains and things like that, um, and it was, like, almost 90 degrees in there, and where I was standing, and it was up, like, four or five flights of stairs, and it smelled like ass in that place. It was so bad. But, um, when you got up in there, it was super hot. And then, um, on top of that, I was standing in front of a window where the sun was just, like, beating in. I don't want to go that way. So I was burning up, and I had my coat on, and I ended up taking my coat off, but I had, like, fleece-lined tights on and, you know, a couple layers of my sh for my shirt. And I was just dying. It was so hot in there. And then when the, he told us that we could go, I was the first person down the stairs. And I stood outside without my coat on for a minute to cool off. And I, I seriously thought I was going to pass out. Like, I just was not feeling good. So, then, <clears throat> we did the tour and everything. And, um, we got to the part where you can do tasting. And I'm not a Miller fan. So, it was like Miller Lite, a couple, like, Line and Kugel IPAs and... So I wasn't interested in drinking. Plus, it was like 11 o'clock in the day, 11 o'clock, you know, during the day, and I knew I was gonna be on the bus for three hours, so I just wasn't feeling it. Um, so then, after that, we stopped at the Mars Cheese Castle on the way home, and it was about one o'clock when we stopped there, I think. And we had lunch there, and it was all right. Um, had a grilled cheese and some soup and then we were like it's a great big huge just store like you can go in and buy a bunch of stuff um not interested in that does this lead anywhere fun up a mountain that i cannot traverse on my mini bike so let's head back over here um i ended up getting some like candy they had like harry potter candy stuff so i got a couple chocolate frogs and some of the um, really nasty uh, jelly beans, the birdie bot jelly beans, and just some other things. There was um, a soda that was like zombie brains, so I got a couple, one for me and one for my husband, and it ended up not being very good, but I didn't have high hopes for it anyways. There were a couple other flavors that were like kitty piddle and um, know, what, dog drool and that kind of stuff. It was pretty funny. <laughs> Alright, bring it on, you fuckers. I just want the car. 
Headlight? No. I'm gonna take that just in case we need cable. Um, but then we headed home and uh, we had to drive through um, Chicago, which was okay. Um, we ended up hitting a couple accidents and that slowed us down a little bit and we were basically on the bus for like three hours and we had to like beg the bus driver to stop and let us pee because you know everybody at least had three beers at the, the cheesecake or the 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 tour the brewery tour including the lady who had fallen down the night before she also was drinking i'm just like oh my gosh can't believe it there's no way i can do that shit um what time is it maybe we should start to head back Maybe we should go off-roading. Um. So yeah, we stopped at a rest stop once we were we were back in Indiana. We weren't very far from where we were, were going to home. Um. Stopped and peed, <laughs> which was awesome. We like cheered for the uh, the bus driver guy. He was super nice. Super funny guy. Oh, I'm... Home is this way? Really? Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Yep. Okay. Oh, damn, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, I broke the volume. Okay, there we go. Um, let's, let's go off-roading. Oh, I'm out of gas, aren't I? I need to pay attention to that. Because I don't seem to do that very well. Oh, there's a bear. Avoid the bear. Oh, dear. I always get myself into trouble when I go off-roading. But, hopefully we'll be alright. The minibike seems to be pretty good. It's blue now. Got a full tank of gas. There's a landmark. Hey, fellas, how's it going? Uh, let's see if we can climb this hill. So, yeah, we didn't get back until, like, 7.30 or 8 on Friday. Uh, but it was fun. Overall, it was pretty fun. Um, are we home already? No way. No way. Oh, this must be a little town... Like, oh no, I haven't been here. This is a new place. Okay, let's drive around. Really, where the hell is this? Oh, there's a nurse. I don't think she saw me there. Wrestle up a board. Um. Oh, also, this week I've been stressing out because my dental assisting stuff is due, and I had not finished it by the time we were going on the trip. And oh sh! Am I? What's going on here? My bad. Come here, people. Stay away from the mini bike. Oh, I feel really like stuttery right now. Probably all the people. Sir, okay, did I check this car? No, I did not. Okay, we out. Uh, 
the next car. <clears throat> but yeah, I was stressing out because I hadn't finished up my, um, my tests that I needed to do online. Another fucking nurse hiding behind the car. Creepy! Um, I took my laptop with me, but like I said, or was trying to say, um, I wasn't able to do any work. We got home really late, not home, but, um, back from the show, really late. Uh, Milwaukee is an hour behind my time, so the show started at, like, 8 or 9 Milwaukee time, which was, like, 10 o'clock my time. And, uh... I was exhausted by the time we got out of there. It was a two hour and a two and a half hour show with like a 15 minute intermission. So um, we were there for a while. Okay, let's, let's look at our map real quick. Let's get the flock out of here. Um, so yeah, all day yesterday, um, I spent getting tests done, and last night I worked on it too, and then, which way is home? And then this morning I was able to finally finish them up. Excuse me. <laughs> That's been trying to come out for a little while. <laughs> I figured I'd just let it out. So yeah, I'm glad that this weekend is over. Um, I wish I was feeling better. So ready for that. I have no idea how far away from home I am. That makes me a little bit nervous. We're gonna go off-roading again. We're doing on gas. I think we're alright. So yeah, we got some fun exploring them today. Found a new, new town. Still didn't find any fucking headlights. This place, I tell ya, it hates me. Like I said, I, I would like to at least maybe do one more uh, episode uh, before the end of the series. We'll see how that goes this week. I have no idea when Alpha 13 is going to drop, but I was talking with Joe yesterday, and he said that he thinks it's going to be here before Thanksgiving, which we have this week, and then next week is Thanksgiving. Um, oh, be quiet! So... I got a new phone, and with it I got a new ringtone, so I don't know if you guys can hear that or not, but it kind of goes along with the last ringtone that I had. Uh, it's still that same theme. I think I can probably turn on a better flashlight. Um, that was my niece's mom. I will call her back here in just a few minutes. Um, okay. Seriously? hung up in the mountains over here. Come on, you can do it. So yeah, this, uh, this phone has all kinds of different noises and weird weirdness that I'm not used to yet. Oh my god, fucking go! Oh my god, the lumberjack guys are so creepy. I should have just stayed on the road. I think I would have been fine on the road. I think this leads us down into our town. Hey, lumberjacks! Maybe it doesn't lead to our little town. Where the hell is my waypoint set? Okay, we're almost there. Um, hopefully we'll get there before it's dark and they're running. Hopefully we can avoid any more, um, mountains and things. I really need a drink. That screaming made my throat hurt. Uh, tree? Wow. 
Lots of trees. Oh my god. I hit it. So many damn trees. Get out of the way, people. Have to take gas. I feel like we should go home, be home any second. Houses. Good, good. Just, oh, I didn't aim for that guy well enough. Oh. Feels so much better to be home. I don't think I put anything in the trunk of this thing. This car. No, everybody has told me that I should put that thing like on a man-made surface and I never have and it seems to be fine okay let's get in here oh yeah I found shotgun shells okay why didn't you stack you turd we should probably cover this back up put a bucket of water here so I can fill in that um, little thingy that we have. But I really don't care that much right now. Okay, this is a good one. Put in the bike eventually. Next time it's safe to do that. Um, don't even have a flashlight on right now. Let's go put some stuff away. this wood that we don't need at the moment. A butt ton of repair kits. Beer. I have all kinds of crap. Okay. Let's go take a look uh, down here. And I actually, you guys might be proud of me. Put down hay bales. Yay! I can fall and not break my legs. Um, do I have any food down here? Oh, yes. Awesome. And we got our grain alcohol production going. Tons of water. Give me those back. Give me those back. Overachieving. Okay. Give me that back. So, water. Where would you be if you were water in here? And then the grain alcohol would be here. So yeah, I think we are set as far as um, gas and stuff. Not that it really matters. This is almost over. Okay. So yeah. I think that's going to be it for tonight. Um, I'll, let's just wait the last 15 minutes just to make sure no hordes come. I don't think it's a horde night. Tomorrow night should be a horde night perhaps. So maybe we will try to do that on camera, um, but the hordes are never um, after day 49, they never come when you think they're going to come so we may or may not have one tomorrow night, but we'll see. Maybe I'll try to get that last episode recorded uh, this week. We'll see how everything goes. Um, stay tuned for um, Man Woman Apocalypse with Joe this week. Like I said, I recorded with my we my webcam and didn't know it was on, so should be interesting just to see my face, my reactions, and all that stuff. And um, and I think we're kind of winding down that series too, and and maybe gonna say goodbye um, as long as Alpha 13 comes out when it's supposed to, or soon, anyways. So yeah, I will um, see you guys in the next episode. If you liked this episode, please leave a like and leave me a comment down below if you have something to say and stay tuned for the for for more i'll see you soon <laughs>